Seven joke siege, everybody, you're with me. One, two, three! Thank you. Yay! <laughs> Vladimir's from Russia, relax. That was not the Chernobyl meltdown. Everything's okay, buddy. It's not a problem. It's kind of a big deal over there in Russia. There's actually a cocktail named after his girlfriend. Yeah, the Moscow Mule. <laughs> Okay, have you seen Matthew's crazy pop guy, popped up eyes? It's insane. He looks like a son of Pennywise and Ronald McDonald. Like he will eat your kids, but only in a Happy Meal. Jeez, I'll tell you where I'm hiding my family. Good lord, I was, I, don't know, I didn't understand any of that. If I'm being completely frank, I've never seen a pop punk Soviet before. It's crazy. Guy looks like a My Chemical Processing Plant. <laughs> Macy is from Montana, and I have nothing bad to say about it, this state, since he moved out from there. Well, I've got some thoughts on Russia here, pal. I, uh, <laughs> if you don't mind my saying so. My big problem is the women are ugly. That's a big issue with Russia. Actually, the prettiest woman from Russia is Vladimir. So that's... <laughs> Matthew moved from Montana because he got tired of bisons harassing him in the mating season. <laughs> He's all high and mighty because he's in good shape, okay? That's what's going on. If my government made me wait in line for six hours to get a loaf of bread, I'd have a jawline too, okay? That's one thing I gotta say. Let's get to the chase. <laughs> Finally, the chase! Matthew looks like a certified sex offender. So I wasn't surprised when I learned he graduated from Catholic school. Wait, was that the joke or are you Joseph Stalin for the punchline? No, uh, that would suck. The difference between you and Stalin is that Stalin could kill. That's the big difference, I don't know. Matthew is such a hipster that he moved from Montana because there were no vegan bison meat option. What is it with this guy in the bison? This is insane. This is nuts. This is, a, this is something. Uh, Vladimir last year dated 10 women in one year. It's pretty crazy. He thought it was just one woman, but then he opened it up and there's another woman inside, and then another woman. And then at the end there was a Cadbury egg. <laughs> Matthew looks like a proof that seven generations of cousin marriage can occur even among capybaras. Okay, he said a word at the end there. It was a punchline. I'm sure it made sense. Last joke? I don't know. I, this reminds me of Rocky Four up here. This is nuts. <laughs> Not, not because, not because it's an American versus a Russian, no. Vladimir reminds me of Rocky because he's a retard with a funny voice who beats his meat all day. Oh, okay. <laughs> Matthew looks like a guy whose only way to find clitoris is to use lookup formal in Excel sheets. Keep it going for this freak show, everybody. Keep it going. Guys, that was awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> In a very Russian move, Vladimir is wearing a No Lives Matter shirt, which is... Yeah. <laughs> He's like that pop punk kid that everyone's like, nobody gets me, but no one can actually get you. No one understands what you're saying. 
Matthew, <laughs> Matthew, Matthew's complaining Sorry, about that. Pass the bell. That was funny. That was passive there. That was funny. You were like, oh, Russian women are fucking ugly. I was like, yeah, you're not going to the sites I'm going to online, sir. I'll tell you that much right now. I don't care if I can't understand what they're saying. I get the picture, okay? <laughs> All right. Kevin Caleb, I want you to start this off. All right, uh, I want to give it up for Vladimir. His real opponent tonight was the English language. And... <laughs> But he had a valiant effort, he had a valiant effort. Uh, I did enjoy, he said, only way to find the clitoris. <laughs> it, was, it was absolutely wonderful, it was absolutely wonderful. Uh, but you know, Matthew, uh, you are proof positive that Russia will lose the war because you came in and you, you craned this fucking thing. I'm going with Matthew Mitchell, I'm going with Matthew Mitchell. Matthew Mitchell gets a phone, give it up. Stephanie? <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was so fun. Matt, Matt, you know you're, you're one of my favorite people, uh, but you do look like a gummy bear melting in a hot car. You do, you are built. You are built like that, but your jokes, your jokes, uh, they, they're solid as always. I'm giving it to you, Matt Mitchell. Okay, Matt Mitchell gets two votes. Yes. Kit Leah. Well, I just want to say, like, Vlad, at least you can leave here knowing you're way hotter than him. Uh, Matt looks like the spokesman for generic paper towels. <laughs> but unfortunately, I feel like he won this pretty clearly. Give it up for Matt. Okay, Matt, three votes, wins the battle, give it up for him. Yes. Nice, Man, nice. I'm glad we finally find out where the Wagner group retreated to. This is... <laughs> Four of you are staying up to date. <laughs> that was a fucking great battle. Uh, Masu, I thought you did a great job. I, uh, I'm gonna give it to Vladimir just because he's fucking roasting his third or fourth language. Fucking great job to him, man. That was fucking great. Okay, Vladimir gets a vote. He's a fucking beast. That's hard to do. That's fucking hard to do, man. That's hard to do. Hilarious. Leah? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Claire. <laughs> Call me whatever you the want. The other girl. <laughs> They're all the same. We're all the same. Us Miss, redheaded. Miss Frizzle crazy. from Matt Banwart's joke. <laughs> you know, I know this is a roast battle, but uh, Matthew, I gotta say, I think you're really like mean tonight. When you said, when you said, like, oh, you said a word at the end of that, that was really fucked up. Okay. I don't think we should talk to each other like that because you know what? You sound like that infomercial at midnight that just keeps going and going and going. Yeah, kind of like that bit there. Holy <laughs> shit. Don't come at me. <laughs> Guys, he's built like a refrigerator. <laughs> she knows a thing or two about refrigerators. You've seen her ass. <laughs> okay, folks. Oh. Oh. McHenry, I'm sorry. Oh, that's right. He tries to come for the woman. He's just like, oh, oh, just trying to keep me here. You got it. Oh, do it. Oh. But he can't okay. find the clitoris. <laughs> These are like two bears fighting over the same piece of salmon. It's insane. Sure. That's okay. Wait, do you have anything else to say? No, no, thank you very much. Okay, cool. I thought that was fun. Okay, that was cool. I uh, love that little back and forth dance. Um, <laughs> Matthew. Right. Great job. Hey, thank you. Matthew Mitchell wins the rose. One more time, though, for fucking Vladimir, man. Thank you so much.